For over 25 years, this has been the epicenter of sports entertainment. We welcome you tonight to the longest running episodic television show in history. Guys, we have a big-time tag team match coming up here. A big-time match with big-time stakes, Michael. Neither one of these superstars can afford a loss right now. The Big Red Machine is here. And from parts unknown, weighing in at 326 pounds, What a terrifying presence. This monstrous abomination extracted from your childhood nightmares. Once the deepest, darkest secret of The Undertaker, Kane's presence is alive and well for the world to see. Whoa, jeez. Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. When I think of tag teams that can make a major impact on today's WWE, I absolutely think of these two teams. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. I'm talking about classic techniques like cutting the ring in half, isolating your opponent, relegating them to your corner, and making frequent tags so that the fresh man is always in the ring. That's how you keep your opponents off balance.
Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. The continuity between tag team partners is crucial. When a team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag, they're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part. And that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match. When you look at the tag teams who have dominated this business, all of them worked well together as a unit and were able to keep an opponent in the ring long enough to make that adversary the focal point of their assault. When a superstar is in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment, they must find a way back to their corner to tag their partner. Something that they have to try is doing create separation between them and their opponent. That space gives a superstar the ability to move and catch their breath. Leg lariat with the arm wrench. Very nice. Corey, you touched on this before. Part of a tag team's ability to be successful is their ability to endure punishment and make their way to their partner when they need to tag out. One way to... He's looking at it. Nail it. This is all but over. Let me tell you, that can cause some serious injury. He might have it. He's back in control here. Oh, man, can Matt Hardy recover from this? He's in a precarious position for sure. Got the shoulders down. Yeah, he's got a lot left in him. Have to put in a little more work than that. And here is Kane in off the tag. And setting him up. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. What a clothesline! Ouch. And off the tag is Jeff Hardy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Got him. Oh, what impact. Given the enormity of Kane's debut at Bad Blood 97, some felt it was just a matter of time before the Big Red Machine owned WWE gold. With the 1998 King of the Ring, Kane showed his full destructive powers when he defeated Stone Cold Steve Austin for the WWE Championship. Oh, nasty impact. Oh boy, he is rolling. Jeff Hardy is in position. Harsh impact. He's in. He's going for the pin. And an early kick out in this unusual matchup. Yeah, it's going to take more than that. Beautiful technique. Oh, going to the top. High risk. Look at this. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there is a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. Going all the way up. Uh-oh, he's in trouble here. Better stay right where he is. Kane is looking at this right. Cut! line. That's what he was looking for, Michael. In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring is Jeff Hardy. He's not going to finish this. One ton bomb! Wow. And will this be it? Oh, ouch. That'll hurt. DDT! The tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of... Ooh. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Kane getting it done. Oh, boy, he is rolling. He goes down hard. Yeah, he's not looking very good at this point, Cole. 
it. Nope. Reverses it. What a stop. Good grief. Jeff Hardy just barely getting out of the way. So quick. And no luck against Kane there. Oh boy, he is rolling. Lights out. DDT connects. I don't think there are two teams I'd rather see square off against each other right now. This is amazing. Jeff Hardy just barely getting out of the way. So quick. He's going for it all. I can't believe this one's still going on, especially... Look out! The elbow! We've seen some great tag team action over the years here in WWE, and... I can attest that this is no different. Tagged in. These superstars have tried everything. They have something left in their arsenal. They have to, but can they dig down deep enough to find it? Boom, what impact! Gets the tag. Double axe handle smash. When this guy's on, look out. Kane with the excellent move to get out. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh, and he reverses it. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Takes him down hard. You gotta love that kind of aggression. Buster. He's getting closer, Corey. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. You're not going to win many matches absorbing punishment like that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Got him slammed down hard. At what point do those thoughts creep in of... What do I have to do to put this match to rest? I don't know. I don't know as a WWE superstar if you ever have those thoughts of self-doubt. Uh-oh. Side effect! Here's his moment. Hover here! He stops the count. This might be it! Oh, my! Not again. Wow! One of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand, right? Uh-oh! You can see the wear and tear that this fight has taken out of these men. One! Two! And he got a near fall out of it. And the match continues. Comes in off the tag. A lot of pride on the line here in this tag team encounter. But only two of these competitors will end up getting what they came for. The win. Quick thinking to avoid that one. Super kick. And that one drops him. Somebody's on a mission tonight. This has been a war. Oof. Another great tag team match here tonight. I don't think the tag team scene has ever been hotter here in WWE. There's got to be some point in the match where those thoughts start to creep in that it could be over. And then you got to dig down deep, get rid of the self-doubt, and continue on toward victory. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh boy, he is rolling. You gotta believe this one's over. These athletes seem to have tried everything in their playbook. Oh, there's more in there. Oh, what disrespect. This one's over by way of disqualification. Here. 
here are your winners, Jeff Hardy and Matt Hardy, the Hardy Boy. You heard the ring announcer. This one's over. And here's your winner. The cerebral assassin has arrived. The mood has changed. The following contest is a tag team championship first round match. This and is Triple H's British world. The spotlight is his home. A Grand pounds. Slam the champion. Game. One of the all-time greats. A former European champion, former Intercontinental champion, tag team champion, and WWE champion. Triple H is right where he belongs in the spotlight with the eyes of the WWE Universe fixated squarely on his chiseled physique. Broke into the main event scene with the likes of The Rock, Mick Foley, Big Show, all at WrestleMania 2000. And has never looked back since. The man has main evented seven WrestleManias and continues to grow his legend in WWE. From the midnight workouts to the endless dieting, Triple H prides himself on always being ready. I just hope Triple H's opponent tonight is as mentally tough as they think they are because the Cerebral Assassin is at the top of the game. And from Victoria, Texas, Weighing in at 252 pounds, the WWE Champion, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Hey, Stone Cold Steve Austin does what he wants, when he wants, and guys, it's paid off for him. Look who's here, the animal, Batista. And from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal, Batista. I cannot believe the WWE Universe's reaction to Batista. They've given him nothing but disrespect. You have to respect the animal.
WWE's Apex Predator. And from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, he is the Apex Predator, the Viper, Randy Orton. Randy Orton began his career by being known as the legend killer. Randy Orton is now simply a legend. And the Viper has shown no signs of slowing down. Just as dangerous now as the day he burst on the scene. Randy Orton's career wasn't built on alliances. The most important thing to Randy Orton has been winning championships. legal men are in the ring oh, and set to start things off here we're ready to go the king of kings triple h is looking as imposing tonight than at any point during his dominant 20 year reign you know normally i'd accuse you of kissing up to the boss byron but that assessment's actually pretty spot on well thanks what a stomp good grief Tag team history was made when the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions were crowned at Backlash 2016. The unlikely duo of Rhino and... There it is, the tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Oh, this is dangerous right here. He misses the dive. And unfortunately for him, there was no water in the pool. There was a lot on the line in the Tag Team Tournament Finals. The Usos wanted to add another Tag Team title reign to their resume and enjoyed the recognition of being the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. The team of Rhino and Heath Slater was the team no one expected to be in the finals. Slater had extra motivation because he was fighting for a WWE contract. And at one point, it seemed like the Usos had everything well in hand, but Rhino and Heath Slater refused to lose. After a gore from Rhino practically cut Jimmy Uso in half, Rhino and Heath Slater went from an unlikely tag team to the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. Never say never in WWE is absolutely right. Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. The spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanche. Austin sets it up. Look at Austin! Luthes press! Luthes press! Look at him go! It's heating up now. Stone Cold can draw the curtains on this fight. Corey, a few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Famers, the Rock and Roll Express. In tag team action, like in singles competition, once a big time. Ooh, spine buster by the animal. He's in the driver's seat now. What a stomp! Good grief! Batista turns it around. Oh, an elbow drop. And here, oh, nasty impact. I'm not sure how much he has left. Uh oh, are we gonna see it? Are we? There it is. It's your favorite move, Saxton. The beast bite. There it is. Oh, no. I don't like Steve Austin's chances in this one. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on. Toughen up. Stunner! Stone Cold with a stunner! But he's got to capitalize now. Shoulders down. This could be it. And he breaks the pin. Just breaking down the opponent. Going 
for broke. Looks like he's awakened from his coma. Oh. Oh, oh. Can he finish the job? That might he's a man among boys right now. Yeah, we all know he's a guy with great skill and endurance. And it's Batista with a reversal. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Steve Austin. Steve Austin, this is going to be big. And Austin, Luthor's press, Luthor's press. Look at him go. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Nobody controls the pace of a match. Stunner. Game, set, match, this, the cover. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. Wow, the ref got hit hard there. He may not get back up, Cole. What power. Randy Orton with the tag. Another great tag team match here tonight. I don't think the tag team scene has ever been hotter here in WWE. In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team match when Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch squared off against welcoming committee members Natalya and Carmella. The rival going for it on harsh impact. This one is over. Oh, no. And Randy Orton makes the cover. Oh, and the wreck gets absolutely floored. Yeah, but let's be honest, the light breeze would knock him over. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee could bring Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair back together. Natalia's power set the tone for the match and gave her team an advantage. That was until Carmella's overconfidence let the Irish last kicker turn the tide and get back into the match. And then it was elementary from there for the Irish-born superstar. Incoming from Austin. What is Randy Orton's best strategy? And Austin, Luthor's press, Luthor's press. Look at him go. This is, he's got him covered. Two. He's got some fight left in him. There's a reason Orton is the face of the WWE. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. Elbow drop with authority. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. I really can't believe what's gone down so far. This match has been even more physical than I thought it would be. Oh boy, he is rolling. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh, just when you thought he had nothing left. Randy Orton got the worst end of that stick. I don't think there are two teams I'd rather see square off against each other right now. This is amazing. Oh boy, he is rolling. That might have done it, Cole. Nobody can sustain a drop like that, Michael. Oh, a debilitating elbow drop. Oh, my goodness, crushing it. Things are not looking very good right now. Gonna have to find a way to regroup. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Tagged in. The tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of a renaissance, and it's because of action like this. And here's Randy Orton showing why he's a master manipulator. Pedigree! That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Shoulders on the mat. And he got a near fall out of it. You'll need to do more to keep Batista down for three. Triple H is getting a serious beating and dealing with the damage. And I'm not sure he even knows where he is. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Oh boy, he is rolling. Here it comes. With this guy's on, look out. 
I don't know about you guys, but it looks to me like these superstars are on their last legs here. These superstars have tried everything. They have something left in their arsenal. They have to, but can they do He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. I can't believe this one's still going on, especially after the beating that's been delivered tonight. Steve Austin doing a great job of turning that around. Boy, Randy Orton never stops. With the tag is Randy Orton. Max Handel finds the mark. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Steve Austin. A lot of pride on the line here in this tag team encounter, but only two of these competitors will end up getting what they came for. The win. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. Getting closer now. Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. We've seen some great tag team action over the years here in WWE, and I can attest that this is no different. Oh, boy, he is rolling. He wants it one more time. Stone Cold Stunner. That has got to be it. Stone Cold can draw the curtains on this fight. And this has got to be it. Two, three. And we have our winners. Here are your winners. The game, Triple H and Stone Cold Steve Austin. The referee's three count ends this one. And there's your winner, folks. These two work so well together, Michael. I'd be surprised if they went their separate ways anytime soon. What an effort we saw here. Truly a great match.